Wow, what a completely opposite game from the last one because we played absolutely outstanding from the start of the game. Um, we actually started off real, real early. We we gave a lot of pressure to Houston early. And with the sequence of play, a nice pass from Ray down the right, opening up DJ Taylor, um, being able to put an awesome cross in that gets bounced around in the box, falls to Bongi. Bongi fakes a shot and then goes into the top of the right corner, just absolutely calm in front of the net and a great finish from Bongi with one, two, three, maybe four, including the, the goalie, or maybe five, including the goalie, uh, players in front of him trying to cover up places to shoot at. It was a great finish from Bongi um, to start out the game. And then, boom, right after that, Ray puts Pookie through with a great, great through ball, and he's away on net. And we've seen Mender a couple times this year with a nice run being through on net. And you're nervous that are we gonna score? This should be an easy goal. But honestly, with when I saw Pookie through on that, I was not worried at all. I I just could tell that he was gonna score because I mean we've seen him do it at Norwich for years. Just when he gets those opportunities, he's gonna finish them. And it was, he slotted it perfectly in the bottom right corner to go up 2-0 and two two zero early in the first 20 minutes, being away from home hot Houston heat. It was the dream start we could have asked for. Um, and we kind of cruised um, into halftime after that. We, after those couple goals, we really didn't give Houston too much. I mean, they had, they had possession, but we didn't give them high quality chances. And, and this was huge having box goal back tonight. Uh, just his defensive, capability stopping keeping everything organized i mean stopping crosses stopping everything that comes in his way almost it was huge to have him back tonight um that just helped everything and and then once we got into the 60th or after halftime we started the game again and going into um i think it was right after a hydration break or right before anyway we make made a three-man sub of Will Trapp coming in for Manuel Reynoso, Ishmael Tajiri coming in for Rosales, Mender coming in for Timu. And I understand the subs. Um, I was obviously mad. At, I was, I was kind of mad at first. I were parking the bus a little bit. I mean, being up two goals, I don't think, is enough for us, considering this year multiple times we've given up a two-goal lead by parking the bus or a one-goal lead by parking the bus by either giving up a goal to, for them to drop – for us to drop two points or them to come back and score two and win. Um, so just that whole instance, I don't like parking the bus, but honestly tonight I was not worried that Houston was going to score. I, I understand we got games coming up, but I don't like taking Ray off the pitch, I think – he really helps us get the ball out of our defense, draw foul, you know, other things in that nature, and, and just being able to find passes to to give our defensive guys a little bit of break sometimes. Because a lot of times when we park the bus, we're just absorbing pressure for the last 20, 30 minutes, and we're allowing the other team to say, hey, create as many chances as you want. Um, and usually they find the back of the net, and, 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 it's, and we ask ourselves why, but it's like we do the same thing. We park the bus – absorb pressure let them create opportunities willy-nilly and, and eventually they're going to get an opportunity that's a high percentage and they're going to score most teams but tonight i just really didn't see a lot from houston um, after that we were defensively good um and i've really been impressed by ismail tajiri who did pick up the third goal later on um bongi has a nice shot that saved i believe um it was a good counter from mender ismail tajiri and uh, bongi and it was just a good, good counter. Tashiri gets his thoughts it away. Good finish. Um, after I believe a bongi shot that um, ends up landing to Shashiri after the save, I believe, or a block. Um, also on the 70th minute, Tapias didn't really look like he picked up an injury, but I think uh, Adrian was being 
um, safe with all the games coming up, bringing on Debassi, getting Debassi some more minutes. Uh, good, to, good to see for the last 30 minutes. But, I mean, we win 3-0. It was actually really um, not really nervy either. Uh, I don't think Houston had too many opportunities. Um, Chase Gasper got subbed on for Houston at the end of the game. It was nice to see him. Wish him nothing but the best. Um, but – what we needed was to get a win, get three points, um, start climbing up the leaderboard or this, not the leaderboard, but yeah, the, uh, the table. So that puts us up to 10. We're still trying to get into playoff spot after just an awful bit of form, not picking up points over the last couple months as we should have been. But we got games coming up quick and fast. We got LAFC this weekend, so it's going to be a tough one. But we're at home. The Pookie party has started. Um, that's just great to see. We just It was an awesome game because we just looked so much more dangerous when we had an actual goal-scoring threat up top as well as all the other pieces around. So, um, yeah, just nothing but good things to say today. Um, Adrian is back on the side after um, being suspended as well as Boxhole. Um I don't believe we had any yellow cards. Maybe. Let me double check. I'm trying to think. I can't think of any off the top of my head. Maybe we had one. But um, I'm going to get into the player ratings and kind of wrap it up. I think that's all I really got. Um, yeah, no yellows from us today. So um, my man of the match, Timo Puki, scores a goal, had some great runs. Um yeah, my man of the match, Timo Puki, uh, nine out of ten. Then, um, yeah, that's my man of the match, uh, Dane St. Clair. In that, nine out of ten, great job from Dane. I almost forgot to mention, it's great to have him back from Canada. I played well for Canada. Uh, unfortunately, they lost to the United States, so he is back now. I, I mean, the United States lost tonight to Panama, so, um, yeah, but we got St. Clair back. Uh, Valentin, I'm going to give a th 3 out of 10. I don't think he was very good tonight, honestly. Um, Tapias, a 4 out of 10. Boxel, a 5 out of 10. DJ Taylor, a 5 out of 10. Um, yeah, I thought I got a couple good crosses early. I think later towards the game we kind of teetered off, but our whole defensive back line I think did. Um Ariaga a five out of ten. Dotson a five out of ten. Bongi an uh, eight out of ten. Emmanuel Reynoso. I'm gonna give him a seven out of ten. Not not Ray's best night. I'm gonna be honest. Um, ref wasn't giving him some of the calls that he usually gets. He was going down a little bit too easy in my opinion. And then Rosales, I'm gonna give a five. So that's starting eleven. I'm gonna go into the subs. Will trap. A five, Ishmael Tazuri, a seven, Mender Garcia, a six, and Baki Debasi, a seven or a six. Um, overall, great game. Um, get the three points, and, and we're back home on Saturday. So, as always, come on, you loons, and thanks for tuning in.